In this lesson, we're going to start working with the cart subtotal endpoint. So in the postman, let's open this endpoint. And this endpoint will take the user ID and returns the JSON result. So let's try to create a method for this endpoint. Inside the Wheel Studio, let's copy this get product by ID method. And paste it here. Right after that, let's rename this method to get card subtotal and then just pass the user ID parameter of integer type inside this method. Then let's copy the URL of your EP endpoint and paste it here. Just make sure to pass the user ID parameter here. Then if you go to the postman, then here you can see that this request will just return the shopping cart total price. So instead of passing the product, let's pass the cart subtotal class here. And then make the return type of this method to task of cart subtotal. Alright, now I will see you in the next lesson.